there guys welcome to another really cool episode here on my youtube channel my name is etna if you are just meeting please consider subscribing for more Today I'm taking you to Kitengela and we're checking out a 6 million Kenya shillings, a three bedroom master on suite unit with a DSQ. You're definitely gonna love this. It's worth it. It's actually sitting on a 50 by 100 plot with a plinth area of 140 square meters of interior space. This is a gated community that comprises of four units. I'm gonna be showcasing type one. I'm talking about the design or layout plan. And after checking it out, if you are interested, you can feel free to call us. We will hook you up as soon as possible. Okay. All right. All right, guys, check this out. Gated community for units. And we're going to explore um, the show house on your right. It's ready clearly. Now, nowadays in Kenya, I've noticed that developers are actually going for gravel. And I'm talking in terms of landscaping because I feel like it's quick and easy to lay. Um, it's some sort of quick fix uh, paving solution, though most people prefer a bit of green spaces, you know, some grass here and there, a garden for spinach, skooma and all that. So I love the fact that here we have a bit of space for all that. So you can have like your garden and at the same time a bit of grass where your kids can run up and down, which I think is fantastic rather than just laying gravel like the whole compound you know um, green spaces are fantastic you can even plant a tree or two where you can sit under and chill when it's hot you know now let's explore this compound um, yep. As we proceed this way, we're going to check out the cloth lens area. But first, there's a DSQ, and the DSQ is on suite. So, this is the washroom. And this is the bedroom space and it's a bedroom with good vibes because there's a beautiful wardrobe unit installed and it's well lit and also you noticed in the bathroom space the tiles black and white a themed washroom beautiful. So you proceed this way on your left. This is like the laundry area. Um, of course, you can see the inlet and outlet done and dusted. I think this is where like you can hang your clothes. So you have like the clothesline area right there, if you know what I'm talking about. And yes, that's basically it in terms of uh, this compound. Now we go inside and start exploring this gorgeous unit. Um, yes. You see what I was talking about? You have all that space. Pale mbele, na hapa kando for your like garden or just grass. I think that is fantastic rather than laying a cocoto all over. You know, we want a bit of green spaces. And the caretakers insisted lazima unekane kwa YouTube channel yangu. So, yeah, there you go. Well, Hi, guys. Oh. <laughs> My name is Alexander. Welcome, Alexander. From Bungoma. 
from Kakamega. Tuma salamu. Na tuma salamu kwa watu wa Kakamega. <laughs> Nawaambia nikikuja wanichinjieko kuku bwana. Thank you. <laughs> Waluya na salamu. Anyway, interesting, right? Now straight ahead we have the front porch. It's a beautiful porch. I love that it's some sort of enclosed porch. You can even add screens, you know, for privacy or when it's raining, but it's not a must. It still looks good. Entering the space, we have the living room area, spacious and well lit. Straight ahead your dining open Next Mm, the kitchen i like it the cabinetry and we have some sort of breakfast by area you can switch it up you know i mean i love this kitchen it's um yeah spacious and we have enough cabinetry what do you think it's like a mini pantry and this door leads to the laundry area that we've already checked out In the house up a cabinetry they've installed the hydraulic cabinet um you know the lift up system uh, which alexander actually calls um you know cabinet zinafunguka kama booty agari oh he's creative <laughs> but it's true now in case you're wondering that's where the fridge goes and there's an allocation for your cooker Next, we explore the shared washroom that doubles up as the guest clock room. Bedroom one fitted with a wardrobe unit and we have some sort of a dressing area and it's well lit. Bedroom number two, it's actually en suite. So this is the washroom. And the bedroom space is a replica of actually bedroom one. What do you think? Leave a comment and let me know. Straight ahead, we explore the master bedroom. So first, we have the washroom. And this is the master bedroom, spacious, and we have a wardrobe unit with sliding doors because the master, you know, a bit of a difference. What do you think? Beautiful wardrobe. Let me remove this stuff. I don't know, your stumbles are taking ice cream or something. Sorry. <laughs> but it's a beautiful wardrobe.
basically it thank you for watching i hope you've enjoyed watching this video and if you are interested please feel free to call that number we'll sort you out asap six million with the dsq all on sweet kinda right <laughs> what do you think thank you for watching my good name is etna i create real estate content if there is something that you enjoy then you can subscribe don't forget to like the video drop a comment and uh, yeah let me catch you later on the next one cheers and bye bye